You know the saying, if you don't have a picture, did it really happen? Well, what about posting a photo of your completed ballot? Verify viewer Tom asked us about the legality of posting a photo of a ballot on social media. So let's verify. Is it legal to post a photo of your completed ballot? Our sources are the National Conference of State Legislatures, New Hampshire House Bill 366, New Hampshire court records, and various state election laws. Each state runs their own elections, and according to the National Conference of State Legislatures, all states have some kind of guidance on how to protect a voter's right to privacy when casting a ballot. To safeguard that right, some states have banned or limited the use of cameras in polling places for decades. But the advent of social media and selfies caused states to question if they needed more restrictions around ballot privacy. In 2014, New Hampshire passed a law prohibiting people from posting pictures of their marked ballots on social media, arguing the pictures could lead to voter intimidation, vote buying, or coercion. But the law didn't stick. A federal court decided that posting a picture of your ballot is protected by the First Amendment right to free speech. Now, Hawaii, Nebraska, Oregon, Colorado, and California are among states that allow people to post photos or selfies of their ballots. But some states don't allow taking photos inside of the polling place at all. In Arizona, if you take a photo within 75 feet of a polling location, you can be charged with a misdemeanor, according to Arizona's Secretary of State. And in Texas, people can't take any wireless device within 100 feet of a polling place. But the state election code doesn't prohibit people from taking pictures of their ballots. So we can verify that rules for taking photos of your ballot vary by state. So before you snap a pic at the polls, make sure to check your state's rules regarding election photography. With your Verify, I'm Ariane Till.